what the Whoa whoa <laughs> Oh my god I already died Okay so we we're supposed to I seen people play this game <clears throat> I like get mad at it but like I mean Well I mean if you get mad at this game you must you must actually suck But guess what? I don't suck Look how good I am, look how good I am. Whoop. I'm already a pro. Whoop. There's no feeling more intense than starting over. If you deleted your homework the day before it was due, as I have, or if you left your wallet at home and you have to go back after spending an hour in the commute. If you won some money at the casino and then put all your winnings on red but it came up black, if you got your best shirt dry cleaned before a wedding and then immediately dropped food on it. That's sad. If you won an argument with a friend and then later discovered that they just returned to their original view. That's also sad. Starting over is harder than starting up. If you're not ready for that, like if you've already had a bad day, then what you're about to go through might be too much. Feel free to go away and come back. Alright, whatever you say. No, I'm joking. I'll be here. Alright, thanks for coming with me on this trip. And I'll understand if you have to take a break at any point. Just well, find how a safe place to stop and quit the game. And don't worry, I'll save your progress, always. Even your mistakes. Oh my god, even my mistakes. How am I supposed to get on this rock? <sighs> Calm down. Calm down. I'm a, I'm gonna launch myself. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, wow. it worked. It worked. Okay, calm down. Oh no, I'm falling. I'm falling. Oh my god. Oh my god. How, what do I do? What do I do? <clears throat> okay, okay, okay. Okay, I'm already a pro. I am already a pro. Look at this skill. This game is a homage to a free game that came out in 2002, titled Sexy Hiking. The author of that game was Jazuo, a mysterious Czech designer who was known at the time as the father of B-games. B-games are rough assemblages of found objects. Designers slap them together very quickly and freely, and they're often too rough and unfriendly to gain much of a following. They're built more for the joy of building them than as polished products. I have no idea what he said, but... Pia! No! Okay, okay. Okay, I'm on... <gasps> Did not mean to do that. Okay, okay. Yeah. Whoop. Bro, how am I supposed to do this? <clears throat> well, probably like this? No. Oh, it's working! Uh. Okay. Nope. Oh my god. Oh, yeah. oh it worked. Okay, okay. Easy, Whoop. easy work. Bro, this game is the easiest game in the world. <laughs> in a certain way, Sexy Hiking is the perfect embodiment of a B game. It's built almost entirely out of found and recycled parts, and it's one of the most unusual and unfriendly games of its time. In it, your task is simply to drag yourself up a mountain with a hammer. And that act of climbing, in the digital world or in real life, has certain essential properties that give the game its flavor. No amount of forward progress is guaranteed. Some cliffs are too sheer or too slippery, and the player is constantly, unremittingly in danger of falling and losing everything. Whatever you say, Bennett Foddy. <gasps> what the heck? The cup. 
<gasps> no, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Oh. Okay. What? A few moments later. No, this what? game is so scary. Cause like, I could fall at any moment. What? Okay, okay. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Oh, it worked, it worked. No. Whoa! Wh anyway, when you start sexy hiking, you're standing I next to this pro. dead tree that blocks the way to the entire rest of the game. It might take you an hour to get over that tree, and a lot of people never got past it. You prod and you poke at it, exploring the limits of your reach and your strength, trying to find a way up and over. And there's a sense of truth in that lack of compromise. Most obstacles in video game worlds are fake. You can be completely confident in your ability to get through them. Once you have the correct method, or the correct equipment, or just by spending enough time. In that sense, every pixelated obstacle in sexy hiking is real. I don't care. It's okay, I didn't, I didn't lose that much progress. I did not lose that much progress. Okay, okay, oh snap, what? I'm a pro, I'm a pro. What? Oh! Uh, it's okay, I did not lose that much progress. What? Oh. Gotta build momentum. Okay. What? How am I supposed to do this? Okay. Oh my god. Please. No, no! I did it! I did it! Okay, slowly pull myself. Hiya! Okay. Oh snap. What? <clears throat> Where am I supposed to go? What? <clears throat> the obstacles in sexy hiking are unyielding, and that makes the game uniquely frustrating. But I'm not sure Jazuo intended to make a frustrating game. The frustration is just essential to the act of climbing, and it's authentic to the process of building a game about climbing. A funny thing happened to me as I was building this mountain. I'd have an idea for a new obstacle, and I'd build it, test it, and it would usually turn out to be unreasonably hard. But I couldn't bring myself to make it easier. It already felt like my inability to get past the new obstacle was my fault as a player rather than as a builder. Imaginary mountains build themselves from our efforts to climb them, and it's our repeated attempts to reach the summit that turns those mountains into something real. When you're building a video game world, you're building with ideas, and that can be like working with quickset cement. You mold your ideas into a certain shape that can be played with, and in the process of playing with them, they begin to harden and set until they're immutable, like rock. And at that point, you can't change the world. Not without breaking it into pieces and starting fresh with new ideas. Wait, so Ben Fadi made this game by himself? I'm gonna have to search that up. But anyways, I don't know how you're supposed to do this. And I don't want to fall. And... Hiya! <gasps> oh, okay. It's okay. Oh my god, nope. Don't, nope. Good. <gasps> no! Okay, okay. Not too far, not too far. Just one. Hiya! Okay. Whoop.
<gasps> yes! Okay, okay. Calm down. Calm down. What? Calm down. <laughs> no! No! Oh. oh my god. I was so close. <gasps> I did it, I did it. Okay, now. Just gotta calm down. Just gotta calm down. <gasps> okay, okay. Okay, okay. Mm. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god, why would they even do this? I'm like, so close to falling. For years now, people have been predicting I'm that free. games would soon be made out of prefabricated objects, bought in a store and assembled into a world. And for the most part, that hasn't happened. Because the objects in the stores are trash. I don't mean they look bad or that they're badly made, although a lot of them are. I mean they're trash in the way that food becomes trash as soon as you put it in the sink. Things are made to be consumed and used in a certain context. And once the moment is gone, they transform into garbage. In the context of technology, those moments pass by in seconds. Oh. Oh. Gotta, gotta do this with momentum. Okay, okay, okay. Dang, I'm already. Over time, we've poured more and more refuse into this vast digital landfill that we call the internet. It now vastly outnumbers and outweighs the things that are fresh and untainted and unused. When everything around us is cultural trash, trash becomes the new medium, the lingua franca of the digital age. And you can build culture out of trash. But only trash culture. B games, B movies, B music, B philosophy. B movie? Maybe this is what digital culture is. A monstrous mountain of trash, the ash heap of creativity's fountain. A landfill with everything we ever thought of in it. How am I supposed to humble? Infinite and unsorted. Oh, okay. I thought I I thought I <clears throat> I am speechless. I am actually speechless. Oh my god. I thought I was about to like lose so much progress. Oh my god. What the heck am I doing? What the heck am I doing? Oh, that actually worked. I don't know what I did, but it worked. Slowly take it out. Okay, okay, we are free. I repeat, we are free. There's 3D models Dang, and records, Gen X's fanfic novels, Scan Magazine's green screen Shia LaBeouf, banned snuff scenes on Live League, Facebook's got lifelike bots with unbranded adverts and candid shots of Kanye and Taylor Swift mashups, car crash epic failed gifs, Russian dashcam vids, discussions of McRibs, discarded, forgotten, unrecycled, muddled, rotten, untitled. What is this guy even talking about? <laughs> okay, so... I don't know if I want to do this. You see that hole right there? I don't want to fall in there. But it's a risk I'm willing to take. Everything's fresh for about six seconds until some newer thing beckons and we hit refresh. That's scary. And there's years of persevering, disappearing into the pile, out of style, out of sight. No! No! Oh my god. No. 
Oh. <gasps> oh my god. I thought I. Okay. Yay! Finally! Whoa. There's a kid up there. Oh my god, there's a mouth up there. What the heck? Oh, you just lost a lot of progress. I did not lose That's a, a lot deep of frustration. A real punch in the gut. You're a punch in the gut. I don't think you're supposed to go that way. No, In this context, slide. it's tempting to make friendly content that's gentle, that lets you churn through it but not earn it. Why make something demanding if it just gets piled up in the landfill, filed in with the bland things? Alright, I think you're supposed to go on the right. What? Yeah. Because... Yeah. Where are you supposed to go? What? Up here? Nope, not what? up there, not up there. Down here! Oof, sorry about oh. that. <clears throat> Dang, I'm a pro. I did the light. No sweat. Okay, yeah, I think you're supposed to go down here. Or nope, nope, you're not supposed to. <gasps> what am I doing? Mm. Yeah, I can't reach over there. How am I supposed to get that? <sighs> oh my god. Oh, it happened again. Keep on trying. Don't let it get to you. It happened again. Me, 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 me. That's, what, that's what you sound like. Oh, I planned all of that. When games were new, they wanted a lot oh my God. Daunting, was... you, taunting you, resetting and delaying you. Players played stoically. Now everyone's turned off by that. They want to burn through it quickly. A quick fix for the fickle. Some tricks for the clicks of the feckless. But that's not you. You're an acrobat. You could swallow a baseball bat. Oh my God. Finally. I was like holding my breath. All right. Now. Of course it gets harder and harder. How am I what am I how? The the camera Oh snap, that was my heart. Okay, I guess I'm supposed to launch off and then grab onto the camera. Oh That's exactly 
calm down. Okay, okay. Now I know what to do. Now I know what to do. Okay, yeah. No. No, did not mean to do that. Please, I'm sorry. Please, just please, please. No, it's slipping. It's slipping. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. Okay, okay, okay. A few moments later. Okay. Now push off. Ooh. Get the couch. Get the other couch. Ooh. Get whatever this is. Ooh. Get the couch again. Get get the camera. Get the, okay. Get the chair. A few moments later. All right. Ooh. Grab the couch. <clears throat> grab the couch. Build momentum. Grab the other couch. No, 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 please. Okay, let's go. Let's go. I'm a pro. I'm a pro. Something filled up my heart with nothing. What? Someone told me not to cry. Now that I'm older, my heart's oh, colder. Look, it's the orange. I can see that it's a lie. The arcade fire. 